y'all we're back with another paris vlog smith family travel and we are going to the louvre that's right that place from the da vinci code so we started off in our hotel waiting on our uber once our driver arrived we went ahead and checked out the scene y'all our driver was really cool this one was laid back he wasn't driving like he was in gta but he didn't speak any english so <laughs> and as you know we are really little little french little french so listening to him and my husband have a conversation was very entertaining in itself <laughs> So we really were just checking out the beautiful views. The architecture, again, is amazing. There's the Ferris wheel for the Louvre. We have made it, y'all. We are at the Louvre. This place is huge. It's the largest art museum on earth. It's known for its glass pyramid markings at the entrance. That's what I've noticed myself from every movie. <laughs> but let's check it out, y'all. So yes, we used um, Apple Maps to guide us to the entrance and that is the diamond pyramids. Of course, we took some family photos in front of it, the Instagram photos <laughs> of us holding the diamond, but any Da Vinci Code, you guys, it's in every movie that's in France. So you have to recognize it, but of course we're going to take our pictures, like I said, we're here. And look, it's actual glass, and here's the entrance. Now let's go ahead and go inside. This is Musée de Louvre, Museum of the Louvre, or the Louvre Museum, sorry. <laughs> So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys some of the cool things we saw. And I'm not going to tell you how to feel about it. I'm not putting everything in here. It's definitely worth a visit to the Louvre yourself. But a nice quote from the Da Vinci Code itself. Telling someone about what a symbol means is like telling someone how music should make them feel. So look at the artwork like we did. Interpret it for yourself. And let's explore the Louvre Museum. The 16th century type stuff. That's pretty cool looking. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That must have been a messed up. Yeah, no. So this must have been. What it was supposed to be, yeah. Well, at least what it looked like before it got right. Right, yeah. That's huge. Woo! So this glue is huge. Oh, look at the detail in there. That's crazy. That's a cool Hmm. Yeah, there you go. Change it to English so you can read it. This long guy was built to the I still like the fact that look at the detail, the light. That's. This is 16th, 17th century. Oh. Proof that I'm going in the right direction. Going to see the Mona Lisa. We have entered the Greek sculpture area, which actually replaced the Royal Apartments. Um, it includes the famous Venus de Milo. It's, I mean, the sculptures are, are, well, you can see, they're gorgeous. Um, the detail in it and it's just I don't know it's an odd to see even in the roof the ceiling as I say <laughs> you can see the details and of course we're still going the right way Mona Lisa the details in the artwork of the ceiling the paintings the gold y'all it's gold everywhere in Paris it is so beautiful and breathtaking even in the sculpture of the centaur adopting a lapith woman 
It's just the details, y'all. Even in the model of the Temple of Zeus in Olympia, y'all look at these details. I guess this is where Zeus was. The other place is where Athena was. The place over there. Right. That was built for Athena, the goddess of death. And this is built for Zeus, the goddess of God of Thanos. Oh. They got all the gods' temples in the ground. They are very realistic about things. <laughs> Here's the famous Venus de Milo. Uh, honestly, this entire section with the Greeks was astonishing. It's beautiful. There's a little history on each one in both French and English. And of course, I took some snippets of some of my faves. Um, it's an awe seeing the statues, the details in the statues. Jeremiah! <laughs> Hi! The Greek goddess, huh? <laughs> Look like something off the walk of the head. The tiny is the... Captain America's first shoot. He's my basketball. You see that ball is there, boy? That's the best of his time. <laughs> He's so silly, but here's the Wayne Victory of Samothrace, and now we're getting into the more Christian Catholic um, paintings of God and Jesus and angels. They're on the ceiling. It's just we were in awe of it. So detailed. They're going to Lord Jesus. I think someone different artwork. than these because the artwork changes. Exactly. Yeah. Here's us with the Pharaoh and right when we entered into the room, y'all. As y'all can see, it was packed just to see my girl, the Mona Lisa. The Mona Lisa does bring everybody out. When I say it's packed, So what do you think? Smile, frown, or smirk? Just saw the Mona Lisa in person and I got emotional. It's beautiful. Beautiful. I love art. So, so I went to go see other paintings. Amazing paintings. Really deep. Um famous paintings um here are a few of my favorite ones but it's so they look so realistic y'all i just it's crazy there was an open window so i took a picture <laughs> and back to the ceilings like this is crazy yes weird Wow. It's not, but it's better than that other seat. So Google Translate was our best friend on this entire trip. This actually reads, Louvre Museum, founded on September 16, 1792, by decree of the Legislative Assembly, opened on August 10, 1793, in execution of the decree given by the National Convention, Apollo Gallery. Y'all, for real. Google Translate, okay? Yeah, got it. Don't we see that in the movie? 
mama. Oh, you see that? Yeah. Here's another statue, and of course we had to get Jeremiah up there <laughs> so he can pose with it. All right, all right then. I was in the bathroom. I guess they're trying to go to some place. They got a lot of food places. So there is a food court attached, including a mall. There will be a complete video on all we ate in Paris, Paris 2023. Thanks again for watching and stay tuned. Thank you guys for watching this video. I truly appreciate your support. Don't forget to scroll over to the bottom right, click my logo, subscribe to my channel, and let's hit the notification button so you don't miss a video. Follow me on all social media, all things like the nail geek, or at Leak the Nail Geek. Check out my website, leakthenailgeek.com. Thumbs up this video, comment below, and until next time, bye.